SBR Videos is sponsored by Sports Cash System. Click on the link below for more information. We are briefing week 15 in college football here at SBR Forum Videos. I'm Peter Loshek, and we're talking right now with Joe Duffy from OffshoreInsiders.com, who's going to cover another three college games with us right now. It's Thursday afternoon. I'm always happy to have uh, Joe take as many games as he's willing to take, and he's usually willing to take whatever I ask him to take. Joe, thanks for being back with us. Thank you, Peter. I love the SBR people, and uh, we'll take all the games that you throw at me. All right, so the first one we're going to cover is a minor one, Memphis at uh, UConn. Give a little plug for OffshoreInsiders.com for anyone who by now still doesn't know how to get in touch with you. Yeah, you know, my old saying is winners talk about winners, losers talk about losers. We actually finally came off a losing weekend in college football, but a big winning five and one the last six in the NFL. Big weekend up. Joe Duffy's picks, offshoreinsiders.com. Okay, sounds great. So you were, you were positive overall this past week then? Um, yes. Okay, yes, great. it was a great Sunday. That's all that matters. All right, Memphis at UConn, not one of the major games uh, this week, but maybe there's some value here, right? UConn is at home. They're pick em. Uh The total's 43. And earlier in the year, Memf uh, UConn, of course, was looking pretty futile, and Memphis was looking, you know, decent. They had a, a good defense um, at times. But in recent games, that has sort of turned around. I mean, Memphis got absolutely blown out at home in their last game uh, to uh, Temple, and they, who is not a good team. And uh, they kind of looked like, you know, they were regressing in all areas. UConn, no, they've won two straight uh, over non, not really that impressive teams, but still wins nonetheless. They're improving a little bit. They're at home. The lines just pick them. If Memphis, you know, has any kind of the same uh, game as they had last game, they will lose this one, and, and UConn will be a good bet. So I guess that's what we're trying to guess here, right? Yeah. No, Peter, when you first asked me to take this game, I said, of course, it should be one of the absolute best games of the year. And then I realized it wasn't a basketball game. It was a football game. <laughs> anyway, uh, no, I do think there is an edge for gamblers here. Because, first of all, Memphis will be traveling quite a distance, 1,236 miles. It is only the third time in the program history that Memphis will be in the Northeast. Now, that may not be all that relevant to, you know, these kids that are, have been there for two, three, four years. But the point is, Memphis just is not used to playing in these conditions. The weather report says it's going to be somewhere in the 30s, the temperature. And UConn is one of those teams that is better than their overall record, says why Paul Pasqualoni, I always thought he was an awful coach. I don't know why UConn hired him. I know they had that, that uh, very influential benefactor who was furious when they hired him, and he turned out to be right. Now UConn has finally recovered from Paul Pasqualoni being just a terrible coach, and they're playing very good football right now. And maybe they're not you know, as great as they've shown their last two games, but they're a whole heck of a lot better than their overall record. A tough travel spot for Memphis. I will definitely be going with UConn. Yeah, I mean, I guess the only uh, question is, is Memphis likely to bounce back here for any reason? I think not, but uh, is there any reason that we might have to, uh, to expect that? Well, like I said, there, I only know a game is a lock after it's over. I'm right. not going to tell you that there's no chance that Memphis is going to right. cover, but Connecticut is playing tremendous football. You know how we like to use that margin of cover statistic. They've covered each of their last two games by 13 and a half points, but if there is somebody out there who likes Memphis, I, before, I would like to hear the reasoning before right. the game right. why Memphis would be a good play. All right, I'm agreeing with you. Joe Duffy from OffshoreInsiders.com. This actually might be uh, one of the better bets of the week. UConn at home. Pick them. Thanks, Joe. Yeah, thank you, Peter. Peter.